accomplishments and controversies as Spokane Mayor David Condon begins his second term. An historic day for Spokane as the city swears in its first second term mayor in 41 years. David Condon renewed his oath of office today, admitting he's made mistakes, but also pledging to work harder to make Spokane the best city in the Pacific Northwest. KXOI Force Jeff Humphrey working for you tonight with a look at some of Condon's first term accomplishments. And Jeff, the mayor likes to see Spokane putting its best foot forward. And Melissa, that was the idea behind renovating the gateway to Spokane here along Division Street. Mayor Condon knows the value of making a good first impression with visitors and this new landscape design rather cleverly dislodged a lot of panhandlers. I, David A. Condon, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear. On this very same day four years ago, Mayor David Condon took the reins of Spokane, pledging to make it the city of choice. With the council's help, Condon almost immediately started hiring more police officers and tasked them with making downtown a safer place to live and work. Four years ago, I stood before you to announce a new day for Spokane. I'm honored to have been given the chance to serve as mayor for the city I love and to work for all of you. Condon's affinity for Spokane is reflected in the improvements he's made in our river's water quality, cleaning up what's been submerged for years, making sure big storms don't dump untreated sewage downstream. From yes, reducing water rates to passing a new park bond and street levy to making strides in reforming and innovating our public safety agencies, our team of city employees has done some incredible work for the citizens of Spokane. But Condon says the work is far from over, pledging to attract the businesses that create new jobs and providing more equality in our quality of life. As Condon's young family looked on, their dad said he wants our kids and grandkids to inherit a more vibrant and diverse city. And I pledge to never take for granted that we live in the best city in the Northwest, the city of choice. Spokane is our town. We are a city of courage. And Melissa, on several occasions, the mayor mentioned the courage it took for Spokane to first compete and then host the World's Fair here back in 1974. Ironically, that was the last time that Spokane re-elected one of its mayors. Well, Jeff, there is a measure of controversy here. Did the mayor say anything about forcing out police chief Frank Straub or the way that sexual harassment claim has been handled? Well, he didn't mention it specifically, but he did concede that he had made some mistakes. But unlike his predecessors, Mayor Condon now has a chance to learn from the couple of things that went wrong during his first term and hopefully continue to make Spokane a better place to live. Reporting in Spokane, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.